Hello, darlings. Happy Tuesday to all of you. Welcome to Let's Build the World. Hello, I'm back. How are you all doing? Thank you so much for being understanding and realize that I just needed to have a few days off to one, look after Blue. Blue has had a poorly leg. I took him to the vets and they they don't know what's wrong with it. They, they said it's just hurting him. He's in pain. So he's on painkillers. He seems to be getting better though. The last couple of days he's walking on it absolutely fine. I'm still not chancing anything. I'm giving, giving him short lead walks rather than letting him off and run riot like he normally does. I'm also carrying him up and down the stairs and like from the bed and from the sofa and stuff just so he's not impacting it too much but still trying to make him use it and things but fingers crossed he seems to be getting better so I don't think I'll have to go back in for a checkup on Friday which is really really good uh, and also I'm also main reasons why I needed a few days off as well I'm currently doing a huge project at the minute I can't tell you what this project is just yet but you will find out Sometime this year. <laughs> Sometime this year. Um, so I that's all I'm saying. So with that being said, there may be some Mondays. I did do a community post on this. There may be some Mondays where I won't be uploading nor streaming. Just so I've got a bit of time to work on said project. So if, yeah, I hope you can understand that. It's just with my upload schedule. I'm uploading five videos a week plus streaming three times a week. It's just not giving me time and I don't want it to eat into my weekends because that will affect my mental health. I like to have time to myself. So I'm glad that you understood that as well. I've bloody missed you all. I really, really have. Very much so, but I'm back now. So we'll carry on where we left off. Um. Also, look at this. Oh, what's that? Oh, oh look at that spot on my cheek. Look at the fucking size of it. I've got concealer on it to try and hide it. But that mirror just showing my tip, my tip. A plaque. I got my YouTube plaque. Um, It's really cool. It's really, really nice. It's a lot heavier than what I thought it was going to be. This is like metal. I didn't realize that this was metal. But this is, yes. I am. So I'm going to put, I'm going to get Tom to put that up like behind me so we can all see it. I'm also getting some new shelves as well. I hate these. I don't know why I bought them. I want some new shelves. Why am I going into what I'm buying for my room? It's because I feel like I'm talking to a friend because I am. And I'm just filling you in on what's been going on. And yeah, I'm so bloody grateful and happy with this. So again, thank you. Thank you to the Academy. God. <laughs> Enough of that. Thank you. I'm just going to pop this down somewhere. There we are. Um, yes, we're going to be building a house for a new family today. Now, I know I said I was going to move on to the Pancakes or Bob's restaurant. We're going to do that next. I want to do another household it, on the same street as where Bob and Eliza lives. Actually, it's going to be their next door neighbours. So we're going to do a... I'll pop a little reference image up here. We're going to do a, an American townhouse kind of style. Still sticking with a New Orleans-esque vibe to it as well. I do want this townhouse to look older than what Bob and Eliza's does. So I want it to maybe not be run down, but you can just see it's aged rather than been renovated. Maybe on the interior we'll have a new kitchen or something, but still sticking with a nice New Orleansy vibe. Um, and we've got a nice family moving into it as well, which I like, will introduce you to now, I think. So yes, let, without further ado, my darlings, let's flop on over to the build mode and stop building. Okay, my darlings, we are on a new lot. So we are right next door to where Bob and Eliza's house is. And this is the family that is going to be moving into this house. Um, This beautiful, iconic queen here is Renee Larkin. I nearly forgot the surname then. This is Renee Larkin. She is a veterinarian. She is a veterinarian. She's also a single mum. Um, she is a single mum to this beautiful girl, Harmony Washington. I think she is absolutely stunning. I cannot wait to get her storyline coming through a little bit more as well. Now, oh, and this is Betty, by the way. Say hi, Betty. Oh, she's a Burmese mountain dog and I'm absolutely for it. Now, Renee's vet or vet veterinary surgery um, will be in the kind of like retail um, commercial lot district that we're going to be building, like near Bob's 
like pancake house and whatnot i just really wanted to get a vet in here and i thought what better person than this iconic queen renee renee is an absolute beaut now she is very outspoken she's very loud as well she is um the life and soul of the party she does like to party still like she really likes to get all the neighbors across for food and she does a big cookout in the garden she's just a very very sociable person which i absolutely love about her um and harmony's a little bit different i wouldn't say she was shy she's just a bit more reserved in what she likes um but she is um a, fit a fitness queen I really want to make Harmony come through. Maybe going into the lines of being like a YouTuber. Maybe that is a... Oh my God, how weird's that? Look at that. Look, look. Look at this. That's the YouTube play button if I've ever seen one. So that's just... um, Yeah, it's meant to be then, isn't it really? So maybe she is going down the road of like vlogging her workouts and stuff. I think I'm going to try and do that kind of like thing. Um, And she likes... She's just... I would say maybe not shy. Maybe just a bit more... Um of an introvert she just likes her own company she likes being but she loves animals she's definitely a big lover of animals she's best friends with betty for a start now these two really really get along they really really do get along as does um renee get on with the dad the dad where is where, where, where are we here's the dad dante now it's only they're still really really good friends they co-parent amazingly dante's already has got a new family we're well, not a new family he just, well, it is a new family, really. And I will be awkwardly moving them onto a lot. Maybe over here. <laughs> maybe over here. But these guys are still really, really good friends. They just, they got together too young. I reckon um, Renee had Harmony when she was quite young as well. Maybe around 18, 19. And yeah, they're, they're best mates as well. But I, I really wanted a dynamic of a family that are... They've got two families, but they still really, really get on with this safe in this safe file. So that is where I'm going with this storyline with these people. I just think it really, really suits, really, really suits it. And I, yeah, I just wanted that. I wanted it. I wanted it in the game. So we're going to be building here and we're going to go for that kind of American townhouse vibe. But I do maybe want to go up a floor more. I don't, I'm unsure on that yet. So don't hold, don't hold me to that. But I might go up three floors um, and we, we are going to awkwardly place um maybe on this lot over here actually maybe a smaller house for them i don't know i don't know where we're going to be putting dante yet but dante washington is absolutely beautiful as well i will flop up a photo of him here that i took in create a sim if you want to see him a bit closer um and we'll be making his new family as well um or other family shall we say yeah we'll do that but yeah i really really like this dynamic between being a single mother i was like ifing around whether to have dante as the single father because we, i do want to have a single father in this world as well but i've decided on putting a single father on one on this lot here which is going to have two households in it and um, so i'm going to do that as well just to pay respect to that as well i mean parents are parents you know so that's what we're going to do but i just love these two i really really wanted to have a character like this in game so yes this is the family this is the family so this will be the larkin household considering renee's took back her kind of maiden name after their divorce um and then obviously harmony has got her father's surname as well that doesn't always happen but with this family in particular it does so without further ado darlings let's get into the build mode and we're going to stop building okay my darlings so here we go i've got a little reference image here and um, the one i just showed you so i'm gonna try and get that coming through here um i think i might need to go there with that don't know what windows i'm going to use yet i think i might choose the same windows as that we've got over here i just think it would suit i think it would look delicious for a start really would uh how have you all been doing i hope you've been all right um thank you once again for all of your amazingly kind words or blue and for me I, I just you guys are amazing you really are i know i keep saying it but you fucking are you know why would i fucking want not want to say it when you actually are amazing bunch of bastards you really are <laughs> me me saying you're amazing and then calling you bastards in the same breath i mean that's just me as a whole really isn't it to be honest um do i want to go like there with it oh i quite like that quite like it quite like it i'm gonna keep everything white for the minute and we'll choose uh, uh is that white or cream i think the lighting's a bit off oh for god's sake the lead of me oh god no oh god no 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 it's just gonna have to say like this the lighting on can't wait to get over to this side <laughs> so i can actually see what i'm doing 
because the lighting on this bit is just not the one, loves. It's really not, really not. Um, it looks a little bit wider. I'm going to keep it like this for the minute. I'm going to keep it like this for the minute, and we're just going to see what happens. So, into a hallway, obviously. Uh, I'm going to do a big double staircase moment here. Um, just pick a... Uh, uh, just pick one that just can be filled in the space for the minute, and it doesn't matter so much at the minute. So it is a Victorian house. This is going to be a Victorian layout as well. But I do want to kind of get across the same sort of vibe as we had um, in the McCarthy's. I did have to go and check their surname then because I definitely wouldn't have got that right. <laughs> Silly bum. I know their names, Beatrix and Christopher, but I could have just said that really now thinking about it, couldn't I? Right, I'm going to... Mm, I might want to widen... No, that's not going to work. Do you know what? I'm not going to do a hallway. I'm just going to do a little, like, I'm going to do an entrance here. And then they just get into the kitchen back here. I wouldn't say it's going to be as big as this. This might be. I don't think we're going to have verandas on the back either. I don't know. I'm unsure of that yet. Probably will because it will kind of marry in quite nicely. But, you know, you've just got to do these things sometimes. So living room we're gonna have an entrance there oh the fireplace is there though that doesn't work out the way i want it to so i'm gonna whiffle the fireplace over to there yes i am indeed oh oh <laughs> a toilet here <laughs> toilet here into a dining ro dining room and then the kitchen can kind of wrap around that bit there i'm gonna make the kitchen a little bit bigger though like that let me see Oh, I like that layout. That would be nice, actually, I think. Yeah, I do like it. I do like it. Okay, we've got that going on. We've got that going on. We're going to go up to the top now. Up on top. We're going to pop a bedroom at the front here. I think I'm just going to build over that. I usually, like, knock that out, but not for this build. I don't think so. Um, I'm going to do a little moment here like this i think this could be one bedroom it's probably a bit big but it's rather too big than too small am i right ladies <laughs> shut up Aiden. absolutely shut up <laughs> just just no is the answer to that <laughs> um i'm gonna do a little office i think i think that could be a good sized office actually mm, maybe a bit no, I, I don't know. I want to get a decent sized bedroom in here as well. So this is going to be quite a decent sized bedroom here. Let me see that. And we're going to whiffle you all the way along so you go in. Okay, we do need to get a bathroom up here as well. So must, that's what I was worrying about the size of this office. I was like, oh, we need a bathroom, darling. So maybe actually what I could do is pop that to there. Let me see that. Oh, that looks delicious. And I think I'll do this as the bathroom. And then this as the little office space for Renee. So maybe we won't. I'm not going to go up. Um, I'm going to put stairs anyway. But we're going to put it up on a height. Now, I know New Orleans houses don't have basements. It wouldn't make sense for them to have basements. Main reasons being um, it's prone to flooding. Is that is that the reason? I don't know. I'm just making that up. It's prone to flooding. It's very prone. It would probably be prone to <laughs> It probably would be prone to flooding, to be honest with you, thinking about it, wouldn't it? Being a very moist place. Um, I'm not enjoying that. I might want to move that to... Why did I put two doors down? <laughs> I might want to move that to there now. Yeah, why did I... why was that there anyway? Just so it frames in the window above. Um, I am going to stick with these skinnier windows than the other house, though, I think. Just for a bit of difference. Yeah, yeah, I am. I'm not going to put shutters on them. Not happening, love. Right. And then I'm going to do a little moment like this. It's not a time to sing Kelly Clarkson, Aiden. It's really... A moment like this. Some people wait a lifetime. <laughs> I know that as Leona Lewis anyway, not Kelly Clarkson. I think Simon got a bit bored and thought, oh, I can't think of a new song for Leona. Leona, just sing this one, darling. No one's going to care anyway. <laughs> Joking. I think Leona Lewis is probably one of the best voices to ever grace any singing competition ever. What happened to her, by the way? Where has she gone? What is her story? 
More on that later. <laughs> More on that later, darlings. Yes, I like that. I do like that. And we're going to go a bit more, as I said, traditional with this build. Um, let's build a ceiling there, darling. But I am going to come across the top with this as well. So I will whiffle that to there. Oh, I'm for it. Oh, absolutely. I'm absolutely for it. Really, um, yes. Okay. Okay. Now, the windows are normally a bit more balanced. Like, maybe can I do four there? Absolutely not, Aiden. Who are you kidding, love? No, I like it. I'm just going to go. I'm just going to do my own style, you know? Build a ceiling there. Gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, we've got, like, it's a lot of, like, Roman-looking pillars, which I'm going to make apparent in here. So let me pick one. Okay, so I've just picked these base game ones, I think, for the minute. They might change, but I kind of like them. And I've also changed the window spacing as well. It just wasn't working with the pillar placement and... That was not a vibe that I was just not happy with. So that's what we've done. We've been and gone and done it. Now, I think I'm going to make the trim a little bit more elaborate in this build in particular. So I may use these. That's making this look weird now, though. Have I not got F5 placement on? Who the fuck do I think I am sometimes? Seriously, Lily. <laughs> Sorry, I'm, <laughs> I'm on a bit of a mad one today, darlings. Um, I think you can all... Just join me in that, to be honest, you know? Let's just join. Let's just let's just enjoy it, shall we? Let's just enjoy the mad one that we I appear to be having today. It's just nice to be back recording, to be honest with you. Yeah. Yeah, I like that. Okay. Okay, we've got spandrels, but the spandrels are gonna be hidden there because of the big girthy freeze. But the spandrel itself can the, the reference image is literally that big. I'm trying to see, and I can't. But we're going to try and just put one in. What about you? Oh, you kind of suit the freeze, actually. So I think I'm going to do that one. What, what the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What? Oh, it's those. No, I don't actually know. Oh, it's the shape of this underneath. All right, let's get rid of the stairs. Let's pull this in. Will this work? No, no, it didn't work. So the freeze is not going there anymore. Never mind. Never fucking mind, eh? Never. Why is that like disappeared there now? What? Oh, Sim, sort your shit out. Seriously. Look. Oh, and it's back. It disappears. Oh, oh, right. <laughs> no, Aiden, I think you need to tell yourself to sort your shit out. Not the Sims. Well, no, I do need to tell the Sims to sort their shit out, to be honest with you. It's making me fuming. It really is. So maybe, can I, no, that will disappear, Aiden. That will be silly. I'm just going to keep the freeze there. It doesn't matter it not being at the top of the stairs. As long as it's on the side. You can't bloody see it anyway. And let's pick a sexy fence. We're going to pick a sexy fence to go on here. I want it to be a little bit ornate-y. Um, ornate is a word, I've decided. Um... Just going to go with it, I think. What about you? Oh, that's kind of pretty. What about you? Oh, you look a bit more Art Deco, though, rather than Victorian. This is a little bit more decorative. But do we... We won't have a matching... Oh, we don't need a banister there anyway. Good, because I hate them. <laughs> All right, aggressive. Fucking hell. Calm those titties. Calm those titties, darling. <laughs> Let me see that. Oh, that's the vibe. Yes. Maybe a white townhouse then. Just like a pure white townhouse. That could look very nice. Oh, I might do that. Yes, I might do that indeed. Why are you disappeared there now? What is your reasons? Why are you Why are you running? Aiden, shush. Shush. Right. And then we're going to do a little half wall moment here. Let me see how tall you are, darling. You're probably going to be a bit too tall. Mm, maybe a little cheeky bit too tall, that one. I think that one. And then we'll go down one and wrap that all the way around to there. To there. To me, to you. <laughs> Who's that? In the comments, whoever can get to me, to you. I think only the Brits are going to be able to get this. Um, You get 10 bumpkin points. So don't say I don't give you anything. <laughs> 
Oh, let me see you. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I don't know if I want to go up one more. No, no, I'm not. It will make the profile of the um the how the street look a bit weird, I think. I am gonna do a roof though, but I'm not gonna show the roof off much. I'm just gonna do the tip. We're just gonna see we're just gonna see the tip. Stop it. Stop it indeed. <laughs> uh let's tuck those flaps in for a start and then whiffle this down. Just so it kind of creeps out over the... T oh, the bastard half wall. Oh. <laughs> I dropped the C-bomb. I'm going to bleep that out anyway. Um, <laughs> but I just... I just called the roof the C-bomb. Um, I will make sure to bleep that out. God, make sure I bleep that out. Right. Eh. <laughs> uh. I don't like that. Come up a little bit more. Yeah, that's better. I just didn't like those gappy bits. Yeah, I like it. I'd like it. I don't know about white now, though. I might want to change the colour. I'm going to have a whiffle through with loads of wallpapers and see what I come up with. Okay, so I've decided on a grey and red moment, I think. I think that looks pretty nice. Yeah, the white was just... Um... And Renee is a colourful person. She loves colourful makeup and clothes and stuff. Living in a white, pristine looking house. I don't think it's the vibe. I want to add a lot of greenery to this build. Um, doing the same sort of thing I did at the McCarthy's with all of the greenery hanging off of the like balconies and stuff. And I think that will pull this build together a little bit more. First up, what I need to do is choose a roof. What did we do there? We did black there. Maybe I could do a black roof on this one as well. But they've just had their, a new roof put on. So we probably want to make it look a little bit more older, this one. Um, these tiles will probably match in quite well. Black would go quite nicely. But I think I'll stick with a grey. I think I will. Um, we need to ignore that that is not around there either. And I need to change that awful trim. It's not letting me eye drop things, for goodness sake. I think I need to change this trim up slightly here as well. Not to blue, Aiden. To grey. Grey. So it's looking a little bit basic at the minute. But that's what always happens when the build first starts. Um, I think the fence around the front. I think I want to do like a quite a Victorian looking fence. And maybe I could use this big iron fence in the front here. In a white. Let me see this. Let me just see if it's going to be the vibe. <gasps> do you know what? That might work. Oh, that might work indeed. I don't think I'm going to put a fence on it. Like a gate, sorry. I think I'm just going to leave it open like that. But I think this this is going to work, my loves. I'm going to wrap you around to about there as well. Into there. Stunning. Let me see that. Yeah, no, no, no. I quite like that. Maybe a shorter one. I don't know. That kind of fills me with vibes. It's giving me more San Francisco though with that. But I don't really mind that. We're not we're not trying too hard to have this mirror New Orleans exactly, you know. But I think this fence might be a slightly bit too big. Um, it looks good, but it's just not it's not doing it for me. What I need to find is a shorter, better one. No, I didn't like it. I tried a shorter one on it, and it looked it, it looks a lot better with this. So I'm going to stick with that. I think. Now, did I use those sidewalk slabs? I did. So I'm going to use it for this build here as well um what can we or shall i tile i might be able to get some tiles here to match in with the um where's the like oh here we go i could tile like the walkway and this um i don't know <laughs> i don't know i don't know yet but i kind of no no i'm gonna sidewalk slab it if you think I'm going to be indecisive today, you'd be correct. You'd be very correct. Yes. Now, I didn't want to wrap this fence all the way around here. I want to do just a normal... What the fuck is that? Oh, it's a leaf. <laughs> what is floating there? What are you? Um, I think I'm going to do the Hedge of Dreams. Is my like... Yeah, it is on. Um, doop -doop -doop -doop. Live edit. Where's the Hedge of Absolute Dreams? There you are, darling. Well, you know you're not. It's this one. And I think I'm not going to size it down. I'm going to have it at a substantial height. All the way around here. Just so we've got privacy. Because you are right on street view here. And then I think here what I'll do. Is just add in a high fence. 
Um, not that kind of one, like this kind of one. Have you got a grey, perhaps? I don't think this is grey, but... Oh, that does match in quite nicely, though. And I think I'll just tie this one all the way around and join it up here. Now, can I fit a fence there? In fact, you know what? I'm just going to get rid of that. I'm going to get rid of that and have that start there. Um, I don't know. That looked a bit weird. That looks a bit strange. Now, the only one that goes get will go here is that huge bloody Victorian one. And I don't think it will fit in. No, it's going to cut through. Look. Oh, you're bad. Oh. oh, that's not too bad. Oh, yeah, we'll do that. Oh, slam. I'm for it. I didn't think that was going to fit in that well, but it does. Um, I'm not going to put it here, though. Because What are you? You're four, aren't you? Yeah, you're four, darling. You're not invited. You're absolutely not invited. Okay, well, let's get some more details on this, I think. I think I'm missing some detail on this build. And let's get a trim on this one here for a start. Is this the right trim for that? No, not really. It needs to be a little bit more. I hate the trims. <laughs> I really do. I really should detest them. Very much a day test. Do I want to make this just a little bit taller? Let me see that. It makes those bloody things poke through weirdly. No, we'll, we'll, we'll put it down there. I'll just put a window up here. I'll put a window up here. I don't know what window though. I think it nice, needs to be a maybe a circular moment up there. Um, will, we, will we be able to get a circular moment? Oh no, that's far too big. Oh god, no, I don't like that either. What about the half moon one? Um... Where's that grey that's not hideous? There we go. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if I like the roof. One sec. Guys, we're doing it. I'm going to show you what I'm doing as well. I think we're going to put a roof like this on. I just wasn't feeling that flat roof. It was just doing something to me. It was making my eyes sad. It was making my soul sad. And do you know what? I'm not here for soul sadness today, my loves. I'm here for soul nurturing. <laughs> I'm not carrying on with that. <laughs> But yeah, <laughs> you know, that's all I have to say. <laughs> that is all I have to absolutely bloody say to the lot of you. And you just got to agree with me. I'm sorry, I don't want no, no naysayers in the comments. I think this roof line is going to look... Yeah, well, it is. I'm going to put dormers on it. <laughs> I just saw it then. I was like, um, I don't know if I like you. <laughs> that camera drop can go to fucking hell as well. Oh my god! If that camera drop lingers for The Sims Five, I'm 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 sorry, but I will be writing a hearty petition to the devs to sort it out. Oh, we're gonna have to move all these up now. I think this will look nice. Yeah, it will. It will. Just one little dormer at the front there. Oh, cute vibes. That's what we're going for. Absolutely for it. Right, you can fuck off. <laughs> sorry, potty mouth today, Aiden. For goodness' sake. Enough of the F-bombs and definitely enough of the C-bombs. <gasps> Can't believe I did that. Well, I can because I use that word every single day of my life. But just not on YouTube. Not on YouTube. Twitch, sometimes it slips out. It does. I can't help it. But, you know, I like a C-bomb. What, what, more, what more needs to be said, to be honest? What more needs to be said indeed? Yeah, I think this is going to work. It does look a little bit tiny. I would have maybe liked it a little bit wider. Shall I widen the house? <laughs> Fuck it. How many more F-bombs? I did it. <laughs> I think we needed to widen it. No, this is not looking right here. Because that needs to be down there and very tall. Um. Oh god, that looks weird. Shall I just like forget... Having like, I'll get rid of those stairs for a start because you're taking the piss. You really are. Obviously, I need to change all of this. Things need to be done. The floor plan needs to change inside. But I'm going to go for a wider house. So it's almost taken over and gone for more colonial vibe. But I think the balance of that looks better with the roof. Do you know what I mean? Hopefully you do. That's what we're going for. Nearly burped then. But I didn't. I held it in like a, like a... Like a good boy. <laughs> God. <laughs> Why am I picking those stairs for a start? Don't know what stairs we're going to use. So we're just going to do some fillers for the minute and I'll I'll figure that out. We're going to be back here tomorrow anyway. And we never get much done on the first kind of like build up of this. We normally come back the second time with fresh eyes and do it that way. But that looks better. Don't you think the balance just looks better? Even with the house next door, that looks better. I do like it with lots of greenery as well. It's going to be a vibe, loves. It really is. Anyway, so 
what I want to do is get, well, I need to pick some roof tiles again because we've got rid of them. Um, is this the right roof tile for it? I don't really like them with it. Maybe I should go black. Oh God, my arm's caught. Um, mm, or maybe you, maybe some tiles. Why is everything looking purple? Stop it. Stop it indeed. I mean, you're not too bad. I don't know. We'll stick that for the minute. We'll see what happens. Um, I might go black with it. I might go darker. Now, let's see if we can get a match in Dorma. <laughs> Good luck with that, Aiden. Good luck. Uh, maybe. We'll stick them on for the minute and we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Um, okay. Okay. I think that's where I'm going to leave it today anyway. This might be, have been a, quite a shorter video than normal. Um, but I think I'm going to leave it where where it is for the minute. Or do we have a matching um, banister with that fence? I don't think we do. So the fence is going to have to change as well. Everything's going to probably be changed by the time you've had a look at this. But um, yeah, I think <laughs> I'm going to leave it there for today. Struggled a bit with this today. I really did. Really did struggle. But... We finally got something in the end. I'm not completely happy with it. So you may notice things changing as the build progresses. But so far, it's not too bad. It's not too bad. It's getting there. Um, and we'll come back tomorrow and we'll do more exterior work. Um, but yes. There we go, my darlings. Thank you so much for coming today. It's so good to be back with you. It really, really is. Leave me some lovely comments and I'll try and reply to as many that I can. As I said, we'll be back tomorrow. We'll carry on with the with the exterior to this. Uh, landscaping is where we need to do some landscaping. You may notice things are different in the thumbnail because I do want to make the build look pretty for the thumbnail. So I might do a little bit of tarting it up off of camera. But yeah, thank you once again. I appreciate every single one of you. I really, really do. Thank you for everything. And I'll be back tomorrow. Goodbye.